I'm going to do a little demonstration with this piezo. It's from uh, one of those fire alarm systems. All I've got here is the piezo uh, transformer and a couple of LEDs. And I'm going to show you what I found out. If you use the piezo and if you tap on it, you know you're going to create some energy. Before I'm going to show you in its full extent, um, I found out something different I would like to show you. And um, it's hard to see, so I'm going to try and visualize it. This is the piezo. Now I'm going to press on it. Um, and you will see that if you will only press on it, there's no light. I found out that if you charge it, you press it once, and you connect, and then you let go, and then you connect again, because of the plus and the minus sign, of course, going in two directions, you can see the LEDs are lighting up. Maybe not as pronounced as you would like to, but it does work. So this is something to think about. It's as if we are charging it. And of course, everybody is going to ask me what would be the output if I would tap on it. So I'm going to tap on it. Be careful, it may be loud. Now what happens if you tap it fast? You get a sort of average light. I, fa I found out as well if you tap it slower, it's a lot better light this way. But let me go back to my original uh, idea, is that by pushing on it and tapping on it, making contact and releasing it, in the right sequence, of course. Well, that's it. That's all I want to show you. Things to know about the piezo. Thank you for watching.